It's showing you how you can construct a rectangle when you are given the length of diagonal and uh, a side. How to construct a rectangle when you are given the length of diagonal and a side. Um, the first thing to do is for us to draw a horizontal line, which I have drawn here, horizontal line of any length, but don't let it to be too long, okay? Uh, the length of diagonal that I'll be using here is 60 millimeters, and the length of side given is 25 millimeters. So, what we need to do first after we have drawn the horizontal line is to, uh, is to take a measurement of 60 millimeters on this line. So, this is the first point. The first end of the line and this is the second end of the line so they are 60 millimeters apart so the next thing i'm going to do here is to uh, label this point as a and this point i will label it as b okay then i'm going to bisect distance a b which is 60 millimeters so we bisect it for us to locate the midpoint of the line so I put my compass at this point and extend to any convenient radius. So I'll draw an arc up here. Okay, I'll draw an arc down here. So I will take the same radius and put at B this point. Okay, so I'll draw an arc here. I'll draw an arc here. So then we are going to draw the bisector. So we join. The point of intersection of the arcs together to get the midpoint like this okay so the midpoint is the midpoint so i will label it point o here so i'm going to take my compass put it at point o here the midpoint of the line and extend it to b or a then i will draw a circle like this okay all right, so with what I've done here, so the next thing I'm going to do is to take a measurement of 25 millimeters, 25 millimeters from my ruler. So this is 25 millimeters. So I'll put the pinpoint at A here, and I will draw an arc up. Then I'll put the same radius, so the pinpoint at B, now draw an arc down here okay so a b is the length of diagonal that we are given so the next thing i'm going to do is that so this point is point c and this point is point d so then i'm going to join a b together so i'll join a b so join a b together like this i'll also join b c together so sorry a d that is a d so I join BC together like this. Then I will join AC. I will join AC like this. So then I will join BD together. All right. So this is the rectangle. So this is how to construct a rectangle. When you are given the length of diagonal and a side of the rectangle, it's as simple as I've shown it here. All you need to do is to practice and practice it, you surely master it. Thank you and God bless you.